Hi everyone, this is Lisa from Happy to Hook Creations. Oops. Uh, today is Tuesday? It is Tuesday, August 16th, 2023. <laughs> so yeah, this is the unboxing. I kept, I was getting ready to open that up and I thought I didn't do a video yet. So this is the Mystery Yarn Challenge Unboxing. It is hosted by Lori of the Armchair Chef. She will be in the description box below. So click on her and show her some love if you are not subscribed to her channel. She does so much. I mean, oh my gosh, that woman. She's She is a busy person. <laughs> so um, I want to say hi to all my subscribers. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me and supporting me and my channel. If today is your birthday, August 16th, happy birthday to you. If today is your anniversary, happy anniversary to you both. And it's the 16th, so there's Elvis stuff all over the place. Um, so quick story before I get into my unboxing. <clears throat> excuse me, and I'm sure I might have mentioned it before, but um, I've got my, <laughs> my, my Happy Meal mug. Caramel Macchiato coffee, caramel, ma caramel Macchiato creamer. So I'm like overflowing with caramel right now. So <clears throat> we were waiting at a hotel because we had already moved out of our, um, we had already moved out of our house. We, my dad had already gotten orders to, um, go to Germany. So we had, you know, we had to be moved into a hotel for, I don't know, two or three weeks until it was time to go because we had another family that was moving in to the house that we had on base when we lived in Fort Bliss. And it was August 16th. My mother is holding my sister who was about 15 days old. Yeah, because she was born August 1st of 77. And I've, I've got a jawbreaker in my mouth. And I'm just like, you know, I'm a kid. I'm like 11, almost 11. I'm sucking on this jawbreaker. And then the news popped up that said that Elvis Presley had died. And that stupid thing got lodged in my throat. Oh, thank God my mother was a nurse. She, you know, she got it out of there, but I have just been absolutely horrified. My kids don't eat jawbreakers. My grandkids don't. I mean, I've got this thing about kids and hard candy. It was just, whoo, whoo, So I tell everybody, I'm like, hmm, yeah. So the day, the day that they announced Elvis died, I almost choked to death on a jawbreaker. Oh my goodness. It was, wow. That's scary. I'm telling you. If you've never choked on anything, I hope you never have to because it is absolutely horrifying. And I was 10. So, so 77. Yeah, it was just days before my birthday because my birthday's Monday. So, um, Elvis died on the 16th. So it was five days before my 11th birthday. And I'm like, oh my God. I'm going to choke to death. I'm not going to make it to my birthday. And you think about things like that when you're only 10 years old, I guess. But yeah, my mom, man, she put my sister down on the bed and she went right into mom slash nurse mode. And um, it took her a minute, but she got it out. Oh boy, horrifying. Anyway, that's it. <laughs> that's my story, guys. I know you didn't want to hear, wow, Lisa almost took death on a on a uh, jawbreaker, but yeah, they're not allowed in my house. My kids know it. My husband knows it. Anybody who knows me knows it. No jawbreakers. No hard candy of any kind that can be lodged in the throat if you're like under 16. <laughs> I'm just like, nope, nope, nope. Won't do it. Let me get another drink of this coffee. I hope you guys are all having a really good day. I am oh, about to start mine. This is my travel day one of them. I have three. So here's the box. Okay. And if you know anything about Lori from the armchair chef, she has been doing this mystery yarn challenge for a year now. It's already been a year. I can't believe it. So this box came from, looks like Arizona. Oh, let me see. Yeah, I think it's Arizona. I'm going to open it up because I had at, oh, Sorry, distraction, distraction, distraction. I see some stuff in there. So I got my card. Let's see what, let's see what's in here. All right. Oh, this is going in my card collection. That is beautiful. And it's little hearts. That is so beautiful. I love that. Man, those are some good colors too. 
Hmm. Yeah, Lisa, I hope you enjoy the yarn and the other goodies. <gasps> There's goodies in the box. <laughs> I watch your channel and really enjoy it. Keep up the good work. Your friend, Kristen. Oh, Kristen, thank you. Wait, it, yeah, enjoy. Yeah, I think this is my, um, this is my yarn person. Yay. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay. So I see chunky yarn. I love chunky yarn. So I have, oh. so there's a uh, soft journal set. Look at that. There's two. I write in a journal just about every day. Um, not only for work, but also for like personal, like today was a really bad day and I'm going to write it down. And I really do do that. Like if I'm having a stressful day, I got to write it down because then it comes out of my brain and I know it's, you know, not being, I'm not yelling at anyone. I write everything down. I really like this. Oh my goodness. To travel is to live. Ah, that's so cool. Look at that. This is the neatest bag. I gotta open it up because there's something in there. I feel that there's, I feel that there's stuff in here. This is, ooh, tea drops. Citrus ginger, orange, lemon, and ginger. Look at that. I've never seen that before. Oh man. Citrus ginger, so there's two of those. I'm just gonna take this out. Uh-oh, I almost dropped something. Wow, Kristen, thank you so much. And I got another neat bag. Ooh, stress relief, lemon ginger, um, root, ru is that Rubus Kai? Chai. Ru ro I don't know how the first name, but it's that's chai tea. Awesome sauce. More stress relief. This is better off red. Nice. Oh, I love tea. I love it so much. Winter spice, savory cinnamon, cardamom, and clove spices. I think I'm going to really like that one. Here's another chai. Oh, chocolate, sweet, ru rubus, rubos, ruibos. Guys, I don't know. And real cocoa. There's that. <laughs> There's that word right there. Honey bush, South African nectar. Wow, I can't wait to try these. Coconut sheet mask. Holy moly. Holler and glow. Aw, that's awesome. Thank you so much, Kristen. Oh my gosh, I gotta put all that right there so I know to have it. Let me take another sip of my coffee. Okay. <gasps> Ooh, there's nerds in here. Sweet and gummy, tangy and crunchy. I've never had these before, but you better believe I'm gonna try them. <laughs> nice. Oh, it's so fun getting goodies. You guys just don't know. Peppermint. Ooh, I love peppermint. Organic lip balm. Guess what? We're opening this up right now. I, okay, I have a problem. I really do. Not just with yarn. I probably, I know I have one in Jack's car. Oh, it smells good. Oh, guys. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. I keep one in my pocket. Oh, man, that's good stuff. Um, the pocket of my, I have like a little cardigan for when it's cold. You know, it could be 90 degrees. It could be 100 degrees outside. But if you go inside a building, They've got the AC cranked up so high that it does tend to get cold. I don't get cold very often, but when I do, I, I have a cardigan that's on the back of my chair at work. And there's, um, I think there's cherry in that one. I've got, now I've got the peppermint. I didn't have any peppermint. I, I, use, I used to have one that I got from Avon because Amanda sells Avon. And um, it was like uh, candy cane. I really outused that sucker, let me tell you. It was awesome. White tea and lily scented soap bar. Oh, my gosh. Oh, that smells so good. This is a thick... Look at how thick that bar of soap is. 
Holy smokes. White tea and lily. Castle bell. Look at that. Oh my gosh, you guys. Almost wish the screen was scratch and sniff. That smells amazing. I'm gonna put that right there. I'm gonna toss that in the trash. I made it, woo woo. Oh boy. Oh, oh I see lots and lots of chunky yarn. I love chunky yarn. Okay, I think there are three. There's, oh my gosh. This is like the endless box of yarn. So it is Hometown USA. That's the five ounce, 81 yards. They are 100% acrylic. This is San Diego Navy. And then I've got, where are you at? Montpelier Peacock. Ooh. Oh, and this is a, this is a bigger one. This is a 10 ounce, 162 yards. And this one is <laughs> my favorite, Dallas Gray. Dallas Gray. Oh my gosh. Okay, and then I've got, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six. There are eight skeins of, uh-oh, I just dropped one. I might, I hope I said that right. right. Mount, Mount Polar Peacock. That is a beautiful color. So there's eight of those. And then one, two, three, four, seven. I have seven of the navy. And then two, which is definitely the equivalent of four or five because, yeah, four of them. Because this is 162 yards of Dallas Gray. There is something else in this bag. Oh my, or in this box. Oh my goodness. Hold on, guys. I'm, I'm like, I feel like this is the, the box of endless goodies. Oh, I love these bags. Oh, oh. I, I can take this when I go shopping. <laughs> Look at that. And then I got another one. Yay. So these are the three, uh-oh. These are the three colors of yarn that I have. Right there. Montpelier, um, Navy, San Diego Navy, and Dallas Gray. Aren't those great? Hmm, what to make, what to make? Well guys, um, <laughs> I think I already know what I'm gonna do since they're chunky yarn, but I'm not telling you. You'll just have to wait and see. Kristen, thank you so much. You definitely know how to pack a box. I'm just really liking this bag. <laughs> I love that that says that. To travel is to live. Oh my goodness, how cool. Thank you so much. And this soap, oh my gosh, that smoke, soap smells amazing. So again, this is hosted by Lori of The Armchair Chef and her link will be in the description box below. There'll be links to my social media, my Facebook page if you're not a member, my Etsy shop, please go over there, like um, a, or favor a few items because as Rose from Rose Likes Crochet says, it really does help find us. So thank you guys so much for watching. I can't wait to show you what I'm going to make. Um, well, I can't wait to show you the finished because, you know, my next video for this will be my finished items anyway, or item. I don't know. Am I going to make more than one? We'll uh, have to see. <laughs> anyway, thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day and uh, I'll see you when I see you. Happy hooking, everyone. Bye-bye.